What's up fam and welcome back to the Black to Business series. Clearly we're in a little bit different of an environment today. We switched it up in the studio um, and we did that for a purpose. It's just there's a different message today. Uh, we're not necessarily talking specifically about business and we're going to complete our conversation with Chef Mimi. Trust and believe we are going to get back to part two. That's going to happen tomorrow at 2.30. Um, but what I want to discuss with you all today is just the importance of black love, the importance of embracing and, and honing in and, and honoring and, and cherishing what we have um, within our community. And I, I just want to encourage everybody here to, to one, to love yourself. Uh, that's where it starts. You really can't love someone else until you learn to love yourself. And, and lastly, uh, it's, it's just to spread that love with as many people as you can. And that, that comes through acts of kindness. It comes from, you know, simply putting others first. It doesn't have to always be, you know, an intimate idea or anything like that. Um, there, there's so many ways to show love to one another. And one, one way that I want to show love to you guys is, is by giving back. And if you follow my Instagram, you know that we're doing a giveaway. And I actually decided I wanted to double up on that giveaway. We have, we have three phenomenal authors that we're going to be featuring um, in the remainder of this Black to Business series. And I'm going to go ahead and feature two right now because I want to do something special uh, for, for the last author that's in the series. So... One of the authors I'm featuring for another business. It's absolutely amazing. She, she, she's an extremely successful woman and an extremely humble woman. And I'm going to go ahead and start off with, with her. Uh, her book is called That Faith, That Trust, That Love. And her name is Jamela Ellis. She owns The Curl Theory in, in Bowie, Maryland, for those who are in the DMV area. Highly recommend that you check out her salon. And we're we're going to be, you know, having a conversation with her towards the latter end of the series. And I highly, you know, I I, I really want you guys to 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 contact all of your cur uh, your curl friends, your naturalistas, um, when we get to that point in time, and I'll let you know. So uh, this is one of her books that she's written, um, and it's a fiction novel, but it, it's faith based and it has a very powerful message. So I want to give this to someone. I want to bless. Well, not my personal copy, but I want to bless somebody uh, with this book. And the second book is Leading While Green. Leading While Green, it kind of just, it, it speaks over my entire life, uh, where I am right now. I'm an emerging leader. You know, I'm a little bit green, but I, I've kind of got my bearings. Um, this is from my coach, Pierre Quinn. It's a phenomenal read. It's it's highly recommended. And definitely check out uh, check out Pierre's podcast. We're going to get out. See, there's so much. I just wanted to give you guys an idea of what's to come. Like the, the series has been phenomenal so far and it just, it's going to maintain that level of greatness. And I'm not saying that in an arrogant way. I'm just saying like the people that I, that I'm featuring are great, you know, and um, I wanted to share that greatness with you guys. So comment, like, and subscribe. Those are the requirements uh, for being eligible to, to win one of the giveaways. And I will definitely, definitely share this with you guys. If you want to, you know, not only be able to lead a team, but also lead yourself because that's where it starts. And also, if you need something that's going to inspire you, that's going to motivate you, get you up in the morning and ready to go, um, I got something for you here as well. So that's it, guys. It, it's a short video. It, it, there's not much to it. I know that you guys are going to be boo loving today and, and doing your thing and going out to restaurants. And I didn't want to take I didn't want to take from that. You know, uh, we'll, we'll always have the Black to Business series to go back and watch. Uh, today is is to share love with one another. And that, that's really all that it's about. So until tomorrow at 2.30 when we finish up our amazing interview with Chef Mimi, um, I just want you guys to keep living your blessed life. All right? I'm probably going to play around a little bit more. Stick around if you'd like to. But if not, I understand. And um, yeah, thank you guys so much for all that you've been doing so far. It truly means a lot to know that, that the work that was put in is being valued and that it's actually applicable to, to individual situations across a broad spectrum. I mean, we have chefs who are giving us advice on, you know, business that, that is that is working for people who own their own hair salons and, and for people who, who have different products. You know, it's just, it's great to see how the diversity within coaching can apply to, to numerous avenues of our personal success. So I'll catch you guys later, all right? Y'all probably don't remember that. Anywho, I'm just gonna go back to noodling around. Clearly I played for church. I, I can't even hide like the churchiness in my playing. Like.
it's, it's, it's unavoidable. Like, it just happens. the intro I'm gonna work on that anywho if you guys are still here I appreciate it but I gotta go myself and I will catch you all later all right peace